morning everyone how are you guys i wish that all of you are fine today we will start revision so we will start with the part of vocabulary focusing on chapter 12 and 13. let's start the first question section a choose the answer that best completes the sentence or answers the question number one which of the following is the opposite of mellow? Strident, stealthy, titanic, or valiant? Yeah, it's strident. Number two, which of the following words could be used to replace strabbing? Frail, or pony, or prony, or fragile? Yes, it's prony. Which of the following words couldn't be used to replace stealthy so which couldn't be focus on the question it's not could be used it's couldn't be used to replace stealthy sly furtive or direct or sneaky yeah it's direct because stealthy is something which is hidden no one can see it so direct it's the opposite of indirect so the opposite of stealthy is direct. Ambiguous means unclear or dangerous, unfortunate or comical. It's unclear because ambiguous something which is it's not clear. Something uh, has some vagueness. Number five, if an idea or issue is indisputable it's unimaginable or simple completely new or beyond question yes it's beyond question titanic beast is fierce or unreal tiny or gigantic yes titanic we, we said that the, the word titanic means very large enormous huge so gigantic mean have the same meaning a distinguishing feature could be called uh, or an atrocity or trade misapprehension optimist or to deal with satisfactorily is to yeah it's number B trade distinguishing feature could be called a trade it's a kind of feature or characteristic of something uh, number eight to deal with satisfactorily is to cope or deter or affirm or stupefy. Yeah, it's number A, cope. It means to deal with something in a satisfactory way. Number nine, which of the following is another word for cling? Adhere or surge or prowl or lag. Yes, actually it's adhere. Number 10, an extremely brutal act could be called a or an, misapprehension, trade, atrocity, or supplement. Yeah, it's number C, atrocity, because it has a, it means to ha having a brutal or a violent act. Section B, state whether the following statements are true or false. Number 11. Another word for kidnap is abduct. Yes, it's true. Abduct is to kidnap or take someone or something by force. So this is why it's true. 12. Public reading of a poem or other work that has been memorized is surge. True or false? No, it's not right. Because public reading of a poem or other work that has been memorized is reciting or recitation number 13 an award that has been given to a volunteer has been conferred yeah it's true because confer is to give a gift or award to someone number 14 an identifying mark or feature is a or an earmark yes it's true because earmark it's 
some marks that are attached and stick to with the ear. This is why it's true. Then the next one, 15, compact means big. False. It's not true. Why? Because compact means small. Firmly or closely packed together or small. So compact means big is false someone who looks on the bright side of, of a thing or a, or an optimist so true or false yes true optimist someone who is hopeful he has a great hope in life it's the opposite of pessimistic optimist someone who has a bright side of things Number 17, a section that has been added to a book in order to update it can be called a or an recitation. False, because we said the definition of recitation before. Uh, recitation means uh, some memorized parts of poetry or prose. Number 18, to fall behind is to lack. Yeah, it's true. 19. If the value of a new discovery is too great to be counted or measured, it can be described as incalculable, true or false. Yeah, it's true because incalculable means something which can't be counted. It's too great to be counted. Countless. Implemented means put an end to. True or false no I don't think that this is right it's false why because implement means to put an huh, an effect yes to implement is to put an effect to something so this is why it's false section C choose the answer that best completes the sentence or answer the question number 21 someone who is fluent a can't be understood b speaks very simply c speaks or writes easily d teaches others to read and write yes it's c speaks or writes easily someone who is fluent in english arabic german and so on 22 if you are deterred from something you are forbidden to do it or encouraged to do it or discouraged about doing it or delaying from starting it actually it's not a is not forbidden to do it and it's not encouraged to do it moreover it's not delayed for starting it so the answer is discouraged about doing it he is not allowed to do this someone who is not encouraging him or her to do it 23 mangled means learned or ruined or compared or excelled at yeah it's be ruined Twenty-four. Which of the following words could be used to replace misapprehension, misunderstanding, approval, displeasure, pain? Yes, it's misunderstanding. It's like comprehension means the way to reach the uh, the, uh, the way of understanding. Misapprehension is the opposite. Misunderstanding. Empowered means plugged, saddened, chugged, enabled. Yes, empowered to give the power to someone. And give him the ability to do something so this is why it's enabled which of the following words couldn't be used to replace surge couldn't be used not could be used it's abbreviation for a uh, slow down first rush wave yeah it's slow down the opposite of surge is slow down it can't be used with the word search a what child doesn't make very good a very good playmate disquieting sulky unscribulous or fluent yes it's sulky a sulky child doesn't make a very good playmate 
Which of the following words is the opposite of honest? Fluent or sulky, disquieting or unscriabulous? Yes, it's number D, unscriabulous. It's the opposite of honest because unscriabulous, it means dishonest. Which of the following words couldn't be used to replace disquieting? A comforting or a valiant or soothing or disturbing? Hmm, it's disturbing. Because quiet, disquieting is the opposite of quiet. So disturbing, someone annoying, bothering. If someone affirmed a fact, he or she questioned it or made it up or denied it or asserted it. Yeah. Affirm is to assert, to assure. Prowling means rolling or sitting or lying or roaming. Yes, roaming. Number D is the correct answer. If you are stupefied, you are asleep, injured or in shock or full of energy. Yes, in shock because it means to surprise or to astonish someone. Which of the following is the opposite of plentiful? Titanic or indisputable or compact or scant? Yeah, it's number D, scant. Because scant means not enough. So the opposite is plentiful, enough and sufficient. A rouse bush that's growing vigorously can be said to be implementing, thriving, maneuvering, parking. Yeah, the correct answer is B, thriving. Which of the following words could be used to refer to an action taken to destroy something or to prevent it from working properly? Sabotage or abduct or earmark or palk, yeah, it's sabotage because sabotage means to stop something from working in a good way or a proper it method if you parked at something you expressed anger for having to do it or refused to do it or did it eagerly or did it have hurtedly let's refuse to do it park means to stop something or refuse doing something which of the following words could be used to replace frigid Palmy, rainy, foggy, freezing. Aha, uh -huh, it's freezing. Number 38. If a training program is intensive, it's what? Concentrated or introductory or useless or costly? Aha, uh -huh, it's concentrated. To give concentration to something. 39. Sir Galat was a... What night of King Arthur's Round Table? Scanty, incalculable, or thrive, or valiant? Uh -huh. The most appropriate answer is valiant night of King Arthur's Round Table because valiant means brave, to act bravely. Maneuver means carry or drag or guide or command yes it means to guide some so that was the last question and the part of the revision of vocabulary so i hope that you understand everything well if you have any difficulty or questions please contact us directly thanks for listening see you next videos